tabs are an efficient way to organize information. The system is quite simple. Featuring on a single page, each tab shows a different content when the user clicks on one. Creating tab with just in mind prototyper is really easy. Use the dynamic panel component to put content on different panels or layers and organize them as you want. First, drag and drop the dynamic panel component in the canvas to create the layers. Once in the canvas, you'll see the dynamic panel includes one default layer only. You can create new layers clicking on the plus button next to the default layer. You can edit the content of each layer, first clicking on the dynamic panel and then on the layer's name. To add components on each layer, just drag and drop them from the component panel onto the canvas. To shape a tab using a text component, you need to give round borders to the rectangle surrounding the text. You can also hide the button border so that you only have the two top corners rounded. Once this is done, you can copy it to create more tabs. Remember that you've only created these tabs on one layer, so you need to copy them on all the others to get a consistent look and feel. Once you've designed the tab on all layers, you need to add interactions. To do so, you need to select the component or tab that will trigger the interaction and open the event window. Start by choosing the type of event you want to apply. Here, the hide and show event. Then select the layers that you want to show after the user clicked on the component. Once this is done, you can repeat the same actions for all the other layers. Finally, simulate the prototype to check for errors.